grateful, mostly, for meeting you, for having someone who cares that I'm here, alive, and not reduced to a cloud of netherese vapor. Someone apart from my tressim, that is. There's nothing that would give me greater pleasure. I'm worried, if I'm being honest. I have so much to live for. More than I thought I'd have again, after Mistra. But being in this place, knowing what lies within poses such a threat. I hope the only heart that's broken here is the Absolutes. I'd never forgive myself for breaking yours. There's nothing that would give me greater pleasure. More excited than I've been in months. I can't tell you how curious I am to learn more about the crown controlling that elder brain. Believe me when I say how important this could be for me, for both of us. Potentially life-saving, so long as we can learn how it could be taken and used. There's nothing that would give me greater pleasure. The same way as you are, I hope. Determined, focused, <laughs> a tad impatient. With the crown, our fates will be in our own hands at last. So long as we don't let go of each other. There's nothing that would give me greater pleasure. At a loss, really. People have always commented on my confidence, sometimes my overconfidence. And in one particularly cutthroat assessment at university, my abject and incorrigible self-delusion. Hmm. To put my faith in someone else, and trust that we will find a better way together. It's a rather new experience for me. One I'm enjoying for the most part. But a new one, nonetheless. <laughs>